On this beautiful winter's day in central Portugal, I'll give you one guess what I am doing. And the sun is streaming into the olive grove. Time to do that. Come, Tandy. Come. Come. You can jump out the car. Good girl. Right. Let's see how much olive picking can be done this morning. My little helper is so tired from the olive picking. She thinks she needs to have a nap. What are you doing hiding over there, hey? You having a little sleep? So, people have asked if I've lost weight. Well, it's hard to show you, but when I walk, my jeans fall off and I no longer need to undo the button or the zip to take them on and off. So I don't know if that answers your question. And here's little Miss Olive. What are you doing? Hmm? What are you doing? Are you smiling for the camera? Back on the olive. What are you doing? Crazy puppy. What are you doing? Yes. Tandy, what are you doing? You're rolling around. Oh my goodness. Now you're hiding underneath it. This is all a big game, eh? I've just been taking the ladder around and doing like a little bit of pruning and then just cleaning off um, those branches. So I have another full little container over here. So I'm thinking, oh, I don't know if I'm going to get to do all the trees, but Thursday is going to be, so I've got... Monday morning, Tuesday morning, Wednesday morning, Thursday I've got the whole day and then what is not picked by the end of Thursday, that's it because um, I've got so much work that I've got to do that I want to start doing on the house that I can't be spending all my time just picking olives. So whatever is not done by Thursday evening is not going to be done. Now what do you say about that Tandy? Hey? What do you say about that? Yes, you've been such a good girl over here diving underneath the branches. We can hardly even see you in the shadow. The struggle is real. I've had to put Moore's um, harvest picking tool that he left behind on the roof because Tandy has decided that it's great to uh, chew on the bamboo all this other stuff to chew on and she wants to chew on that bamboo yes she's got her food and water over here she keeps on jumping into the olives trying to gather that um, by myself was not easy and was made more difficult with a little puppy that um, thought I was giving her free rides <laughs> on this olive cloth. Yes, I'm talking about you. What are you doing? No, leave that back. I'm going. And what are you doing on my olive cloth again? What are you doing here? How am I supposed to sort these olives? 
if you are lying there like that, hey? Why are you doing this? Ow! Don't bite me. Why are you rolling on the olives? The olives are all inside there. Are you trying to make oil for us? Are you trying to make the oil? Ah. I'm getting chills when they tell me you're not yourself Trying to move, but it's hard, I'm out of Whatever they call us, whatever they'll do They're running in circles, circle our fools Whatever we will miss, got nothing to prove But in the dark we're starting to Whatever they call us, whatever they'll do We're running together, I'll be here for you Whatever we will miss, we'll find something new But in the dark I'm starting Whatever they call us, whatever they do, they're running in circles, circle of fools. Whatever we will means got nothing to prove. But in the dark, I'm starting to. Whatever they call us, whatever they do, we want it together. I'll be here for you. Whatever we will miss, we find something new. But in the dark, I'm starting to. So I've done a little sketch on how I plan to do the um, frame for the solar panels. So I was thinking that if I could just, um, yeah, I'm going to have a frame that's going to have legs going down on those sides over there. And then a piece that goes across over there. And then attached with hinges legs that come down and have like little feet thingies that go up and so then the solar panel will rest on that and then because it's got hinges i can move that back frame piece um out or in or whatever to create different um uh, i can't think of the word now like a different angle that's it different angles <laughs> For, or different tilts for the solar panels. So I'm just going to keep it really simple. Um, that's something that I know I can build myself. So that's the plan. But I've got to first get all the um, my olive harvesting done. So this week 
is my last week for working on olives. Um, I've got a, yeah, I've got a three day online work this week as well. So to uh, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, but um, I'm going to do the olives in the morning because I start just after lunch each day. And then hopefully I'll be finished with olives that I can get onto. I've got to buy the hinges and stuff, so I've got to be able to get to Castella Branca. I've got to buy guttering so, um, as well. So I've got quite a lot of shopping to do, but that will be the end of the week. So... In the meantime, I'm going to be doing some measuring. So when I go to the shops, I know exactly the measurements of things I've got to buy. I'm going to do some measuring because um, I'm going to measure these trenches so I can see how much pipe I've got to get. And I'm going to measure this area where the spare room is going to be. So I have my little tape measure and my notebook. So you can hear them busy with the olives um, on the farm next door. The people are never ever there, but they seem to have come just for olive picking and I'm sure they will disappear again. Okay, so I think this room is actually um, going to be much bigger than it seems because it is 530 meters by 480 meters. So I just need to make a note of that. Right, time for the next bit of measuring. I will need to measure the solar panels as well to see what size I'm going to have to cut that. So let's go.
to about two meters for the solar panels. Just careful, don't fall in that hole because I can't get you out. Right, so this is where the vermi composting thing is going to go. Um, let me just get a measurement of this quickly. No, Vitandi, get away from the side. Get away from the side. Oh God, don't, you're going to fall in and then I can't get you out. Okay, right. I'm too nervous to measure over here with... Tandy, come here. You're going to fall in there. Come here. Hey, get away from there. Come. Let's rather measure down here. Right, because if you fall in this hole, then I can at least get you out. Yes. No, don't keep going there. <laughs> ah! Right. Maybe I must come and measure this another day. Okay, so this is going to be where the grey water will go. How are we going to measure this, Sandy? Hmm? You're helping me. How are we going to measure this? How are we going to keep this down over there to get an idea? running up and down these trenches and sliding in the sand. Now we've got to try and get you out of here. What are you doing? Are you digging some more? You're digging more trenches. I don't think people are even going to be able to see you in the shadow over here. You're going to look just like the soil. So I've done um, some more olive picking today. Um, I have managed to get yesterday and today I've got two of these bags full of olives I'll take it to the Nagar tomorrow I'm not going to have time to do it today um, I've been collecting bottles people have been uh, donating bottles for my bottle walk but um, yeah, I'm, I'm quite pleased with this. I'm hoping it's going to come to 30 kilos, but I don't know. Because if this is 30 kilos, then I've taken in 50 kilos, 70 kilos, and then this, this would make it 150. And I've actually only done four trees and not even properly because you can see here. There's still lots of olives, especially the higher parts of the trees. So as much as I've harvested, there's still, there's still more. So I've done four trees, but not even four trees properly. There is just so much. I've got 10 trees in all over here. So um, I still have a way to go. Um, my large green olives are, the eating olives are now um, changing color. So this needs to be picked. I'll see how I go tomorrow. Tomorrow I've also only got 
Yeah, well, that tomorrow is Wednesday, so it's Wednesday morning. I've just got Wednesday morning again, but I've got Thursday the whole day. And um, so if I can take in these olives tomorrow morning early and um, and then there are a lot of these big eating olives on this tree I haven't really touched this tree at all just to take some off to Brian about a month ago I know it's not another <laughs> terribly exciting video, um, just busy with all this online work and uh, meet lots of meetings and olive picking in between um, lunch breaks and yeah, if it starts at two o'clock in the afternoon, then um, I'm here picking olives beforehand. So. I apologize, but it should start once I finish with these olives. Um, there's a lot of work that I plan to get started doing and it will get more exciting, I promise. So if you can just subscribe, if you haven't subscribed before, buy a coffee if you'd like to um, support me in any way um, you can uh, like comment below and yeah it's been uh, quite tiring today <laughs> but um, I'm getting it done and I'm getting through it slowly but surely so um, that's it slowly but surely so keep safe, keep sane, and I'll see you on the next video. Hey now, honey, I've been driving around in my car, looking for some kind of open bar. It's gonna be all right, gonna be all right. Got no money, but I'll work it out with my charm. Having a good time and doing no harm. It's gonna be all right, gonna be all right. Hey now, honey, I've been driving around in my car, looking for some kind of open bar. It's gonna be all right, gonna be all right. But I'll work it out with my charm Having a good time and doing no harm It's gonna be alright, gonna be alright